Ooh, we can open that to the back door. <gasps> oh my god! It's Jessica and welcome back to The Last of Us. So today we are going to be taking a look at the DLC Left Behind and uh, this is a side story, the events before The Last of Us, at least the main core of Ellie's story before we meet her with Joel and stuff like that. Uh, I know this is like her uh, relationship with Riley, her friend that she kept mentioning during the story. And uh, personally, I have never played the DLC before, so this is my first time like going into it. So I am totally ready for this. I expect to cry just because I, you know, how much I love Ellie and stuff like that, and how much she talked about Riley uh, with Joel and how much uh, Riley meant to her. Um, I bet we're gonna see like that, you know, example of it. So let's begin. Oh, so it stops up here. Okay. Oh. What the fuck are these guys? Mm. So yeah, if you guys remember that, when they were in the university and Joel passed out. Joel. Put your armor on me. Oh god. So I guess we're gonna see how Ellie like fend for herself when Joel was out of commission, I guess. Cause we only saw a little bit of that when she met David. I think we're safe. Joel? Joel? Um Joel. I always wondered how was she able to carry Joel? Because like, you know, Ellie's a tiny girl. And Joel is like a huge guy, like you know what I mean? Hopefully that will be answered here. Oh, this is different. That's Riley! I landed on my hip. What the hell? I thought I was bitten. I know. It was kind of awesome. Was it? You're not gonna kill me, are you? I haven't seen you, and I don't even know how long. 45 days? Well, 46, technically. Wanna know what I've been up to? All this time? I thought you were dead. Yeah. Here. Look. No way. Still no roommate? So wait, this is the orphanage, right? The boarding school or whatever? I know how bad that girl smelled. Riley Abel. Firefly. You still have it up. That's cute. What? What are you doing? I'm making sure I don't get caught with the firefly. Relax. There are no soldiers on the entire floor. Here. Congrats. Hey. Are we cool? Are we cool? I disappeared and you're mad. Yeah. And I owe you an explanation. Let's get out of here and I'll tell you all about it. Why can't you tell me here? <laughs> and I have military drills. You know, where we learn how to kill fireflies. Put some pants on and let's go. It's <sighs> so dumb. Come on. When have we ever gotten into trouble? Um. When someone says that, you know they're gonna get in trouble. What is she duct taping him? Oh my god, it's pouring out of him. Oh, it's her shirt! I was wondering what happened to her shirt. She gave it to Joel! Oh my god. And yeah, I guess you wouldn't really know what to do, like how to cover the wound. 
It's the best you could do right now. I should buy us some time. Find something to stitch you up, okay? She needed to put pressure on him, but like, what can you Callus, use? Keep an eye on him. Oh, Callus! I'll be back in a flash. Oh God. The last of us left behind. Oh man, I'm gonna start crying already. <laughs> Oh, that's smart. She locked it. That's good. Where did we get the lock, though? I have no idea. Yo, where are we? In a mall? I don't have any bullets! That's right! Why would Ellie have anything? Because Joel has all of it? Oh, crap. Okay. I gotta remember the controls. It's been a while since I played. Okay. Let's see if there's anything I can use. Hopefully there's no, like, um, infected around, or people, I should say. Especially David's people. Infected, right? I don't like it. Weston's pharmacy. Ooh, okay. Oh, shit. How do I grab stuff again? Triangle. Okay. Sorry, because I just finished playing Tomb Raider, so like my controls are kind of backwards. <laughs> okay. Um I guess we can just go in here, right? See if they have anything. What is it? Pills and leave the bottle? Oh, damn it! Okay, so no pills, just the bottle. Nothing? On. Fuck. Of course. Everything's picture perfect. Yep. Oh my god, that scared me! Oh my god, I thought that was a legit guy. I'm like, what are you doing? <laughs> god damn it. What? Combination 3530, okay. Pharmacist went crazy and attacked me. I hit him pretty hard. He's unconscious and I locked him in the American Prince's store next door. Please get him um, help. 353031, okay. I think he's bitten. That's that's why he attacked the guy. That's probably what happened. Okay. Before I go into there, I'm just gonna see if there's anything else. Ooh, can make that a shiv. Yeah, I bet the pharmacist is the one who has something, right? Just want to be sure if there's anything else I can grab before I leave. Here we go. Anything? Anything? Damn it. Okay, let's see what's in the back. Is it really locked? Oh damn it! How the fuck do I get inside? Can I build something? Wait, wait. I can't craft anything at all. Oh god. All right, I guess I gotta go next door to the prince's shop or whatever the hell it's called. Where is that? Oh, this one, American Princess. Okay, here we go. I don't know what's in here. Sumi, the guy's dead! Uh, I don't like it. I don't hear anything so far, but. Ugh. Oh, crap. Ew, and then has like those like creepy porcelain dolls. I hate those. Same. Please just do that now. Fuck my ass. Can I make anything yet? Fuck, I can't. Okay. I guess I'll just take it slow. I'm sure this will be fine. 
Oh my god. I don't see anything. So far. Ew! Where's the guy then? Pharmacist, would you just come out already? I don't see anyone. Where the hell is this guy? Ew. Oh. Is this him? Ugh! No keys or anything? Ooh, we can open that to the back door. <gasps> oh my god! You fuck! You scared me! <sighs> Asshole! <laughs> oh. Think about me while I'm off. I'll be missing you, but not too much Laura. Probably like the girlfriend or the wife. That sucks. God, that guy scared me though. Oh, shit. What? No! What? Is that the only one? Okay, hang on. Okay, where did that come from? I don't like that. That's not good. I don't- I don't like that. Alright, let's go back in here. Okay. Maybe now I can open the store. Yes. Anything? No. Are you serious? There has to be something we can give to Joel. <sighs> Shit. Oh. The military helicopter. Ooh, maybe we can get something in there, right? Okay, hang on. Okay, I don't like it. Too quiet again. There has to be... something here. Oh, got my light. Okay. I have to get to the helicopter, but it's not gonna be easy. Oh god. Oh, are you serious? Damn it. I have to go the other way. It's like a freaking maze. What is this, a nail salon? Oh, there's someone here. Ah, no sutures. There's a band-aid at least! That's the, probably from the helicopter, right? Salon note. Chief Warrant Officer Larry Caulfield died bravely this afternoon. We were flying to the quarantine zone when our patient turned. Uh, it must have been spores because none of us saw the bite. The patient broke through the restraints and fell uh, upon our pilot. Uh, W.O. Sean Brendan. Even though the helicopter was spinning out of control, Officer Caulfield fought the infection, infected patient, saving our lives. He crashed in the rural Co Colorado Mall. Private Eugene Ellis, Officer Caulfield, and I were the only survivors. In subduing the infected, Officer Caulfield was bitten on the neck. Yeesh! Immediately showed us the bite and accepted his fate. I executed the infected infection protocol before the Officer Caulfield could turn to infected. May he rest in peace. Captain Regain Francis, 4th Infirmary Division, Denver, Quarantine Zone. So that's what happened. That's why they crashed. Okay. Alright. Just gonna make it over there. <laughs> I'm sure there's like nothing down here, right? It's empty. Why would there be anything here? Oh god. Here we go. What happened? Hurry. Oh, we're back with Riley, okay. <laughs> What happened? You got fast there. I'm impressed. Thanks. <laughs> well, come on.
Come on. Up we go. Okay, uh, where are we so, going, though? How did you find them? The fireflies? Yeah. <laughs> remember that firefly you bit and stole his gun? Yeah, I remember him. That's Trevor. I saw him walking down the street, so I tailed his ass. I followed him into this alley, and all these fireflies ambushed me. They took me right to their hideout. To Marlene. Were you scared? Terrified. I thought this time she would actually shoot me. But instead, she just says, what took you so long? <laughs> she was expecting me. And she just made you a firefly? Something like that. That whole almost killing me thing was a test. She wanted to know I was committed. Oh. I find it interesting that Ellie's not, like, with the fireflies right away. Because, you know, Marlene was, like, friends with her mom and stuff. Who do you hang out with these days? I don't know. No one, really. What about Tino and the rest of the guys? How are they doing? Riley, those are your friends. But you talk to them. Yeah, I guess. I guess there's nothing really we can pick up, right? We're just gonna follow Riley. Ooh, what's that? Have you found the light yet? Oh, ha, ha. oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to offend your people. So what? You buy into this whole thing now? All I know is that I'm not a soldier. Or maybe like she didn't want Ellie to join the Fireflyers yet, just because. She wanted to protect her? Thirty days, my ass. People are getting infected all the time. They would do a good job of hiding it. Mm-hmm. You've run into more infected? As part of my initiation, they actually made me kill this man. You know, let's talk about something else. Oh shit, hi! What? The military. Man. Sorry. It's okay. I don't blame her, honestly. Like, you know. Careful, it's wet. Hey, so maybe I should join the fireflies. Ellie. That was the first thing I asked my name. She wants you safe at that stupid school. Okay. I'm not even supposed to come see you. That makes sense. She's worried I'll get you into trouble. Whatever. I can get into trouble just fine on my own. I guess it's because it's like her promise to Anna, right? She's like, I'll keep her safe. So she just forced her into the military hey, school. Remember the first time I brought you here? What are we doing here, Riley? I have a surprise for you. What? What? <laughs> Is it a dinosaur? Maybe. <laughs> They're so cute. Dinosaur. You'll just have to wait and see. This is pretty cool, though. Is this the same mall we're at? No, it's not, right? I think it's just, like, similar. You know, I got them back. Our water guns? Bullshit. You telling me Corporal Dickhead gave them back to you? <laughs> of course not. I had to sneak into his office. Riley, I had them in my hands. <laughs> but your ass got caught. But my ass got caught. It's really weird seeing like a mall all like disheveled and stuff Can't like that. Gone. You heard? Yeah. Do you know how it happened? They said he just fell off his horse. Heart attack or something. Man. Well, how many people get to die of natural causes in this room? That's true too. None the most likely either. called it causes like yeah. murder or infected. So, let's see what he left us. Really? Does he have anything? Just with some old clothes and stuff. What? Is this Winston? <laughs> Man, the guy used to be handsome. <laughs> Bingo. Martha? Oh. Okay, I do not pertain to children drinking alcohol, but this is a video game, so it's not real life. They're in the apocalypse, so sure! <laughs> sure. Watch out, that's not beer. Oh. <laughs> oh my god! Oh, here, 
disgusting. I told you. Cheers, Winston. <laughs> Ooh. That's strong. Come on. Okay, we'll just put it back, I guess. <laughs> They're just being like dumb teenagers, like sneaking out, trying different things, like, you know. What happened to Princess? I assumed after Winston died, they took her. Poor horse. She's probably out there terrified. Oh. <sighs> yeah, most likely whoever was around just took the horse. Or she got eaten, worst case scenario. Are we going under there? Ellie, help me lift this. Okay. <clears throat> it always feels like we're gonna get crushed. It's fine. I'll go first. Ooh. Ooh. So they've been here before then. This is like the thing. They sneak out here. How about we find another way? Yeah, let's do that. I don't I prefer not to get crushed by a car. Thanks. Uh do we have to go back? I guess we do. I don't know. Oh, how about through here? Can we go through here? Hey, Riley. You know what? I'll get you up and over. See if you can unlock it from the side. Good call. Well, you see anything? Riley? Riley? Hello? Oh. <laughs> Whoa. It's a Halloween store. Pa party store. <laughs> you dick, that's two times today. <laughs> How the hell did we never find this place? Come on, I got the perfect mask for you. What? Riley, perfect. Check it out. Werewolf? Is that like a wolf man or something? Put it on. <laughs> so stupid. <laughs> it's so stupid and she puts it on anyway. <laughs> yeah, bad ass. Now who are <sighs> Roar. <laughs> Ellen. Really? Fucking roar. Oh, I gotta build it up! They shouldn't be making noises, but I know they're just being kids. Cool, okay, let's check out what else is in it. Spooky skeletons! Spooky town, okay. There's like a bunch of like Halloween costumes and stuff. Ooh, what's this? Ask Skelethier a question and shake for your fortune. Okay. Are we gonna die today? Nothing. It's probably broken. You gotta turn it over, Jeannie. Oh. What? Seems dreadfully unlikely. Ah. Whew. We're relieved. Uh. She's gonna die, but Ellie isn't. Because remember, she's in The Last of Us. Like, my friend was the first to go. So that kind of sucks. Oh, triple teasing. Put on the bird mask. See what it looks like. What do you think? <laughs> Why, thank you, kind pigeon. <laughs> Alright, let's see if there's anything else we can look at. Ooh, fashion show. Yo, I would totally wear this. Check this out. That's pretty hot. Also, this guy, too. Sweet vampire stuff. Okay. <laughs> What's that? Eyeballs? <laughs> I don't get it. Of course not. She's never experienced Halloween or anything like that. Or any of the holidays for that matter. Oh my god. <sighs> Riley, you gotta stop doing that. Wow. How do you look? I am Count Dracula. <laughs> 
Countess. Yes. I am Countess Dracula. <laughs> <laughs> what a bunch of dorks. It's interesting that they know that. Because, like, oh, I guess they would learn through books and stuff like that, right? But that's pretty cool that they know the stories from before the apocalypse. Alright, that was enough fun at the Halloween store. Let's see what else we can do. What? See those cars down there? Yeah. Red one's yours. Are you kidding me? Yo! Like the brick okay, but also we're gonna make noise, are we not? The has to answer a question. No sarcasm. <laughs> what is this, truth or truth? Alright, cool. You're on. Uh, she said red was mine, right? Ah yeah. Oh. I need more bricks. Damn it. All right. She's going to beat me, isn't she? Yeah, you like that? Here we go. Damn it! Fuck. There. Damn it. Oh, come on. <laughs> I'm so bad at this. Yes. Boom. And this one. Heh heh heh. Okay. I have to go back. Why did you leave? Why did you last child? Did Marley mention my mom? Forget it. Oh. D okay, I'm gonna ask about the mom because I'm curious. So, what does Marlene say about my mom? Not much. I gathered that they were friends even before the outbreak. Oh, and she said your mom was a nurse. A nurse? Apparently they like argued and fought. Oh. Sound familiar? Right. Come on, let me show you this thing. We're oh, right. what the hell? I didn't even know she was a nurse. Oh, that makes a lot of sense why she would get bit then, right? Because like she was always like helping people, and I'm assuming she was trying to help someone who was bit, and then she got bit. Oh wow. Okay, I had no idea. What are we doing here? Same. So, you know how we thought they only powered certain areas of the city? Yeah. Follow me. I don't like this. This is gonna make a lot of noise. Riley, are you sure this is a good idea? The whole city has power. They just flip the circuit breakers. All you gotta do is flip it back. Really? There's no way this is gonna work. So wait, that's true, that all the cities have power, they just turn them off? What did I tell you? I guess that would make sense to conserve it. So the whole mall is lit up? Let's go find out. Uh, again, I, I love it that they're being dorks and like, you know, having fun, but like, I'm scared. <laughs> wait, I, I know what you're trying to do. I'm really glad that you're not dead. I mean, I'm glad that we're back together. Oh. I didn't mean it. All that stuff I said before I left. I didn't mean any of it. Riley, you're such a sap. 
<laughs> They're so cute. <laughs> oh man. Are you ready? Totally. <laughs> Are you kidding? What? What happened? Okay guys, I'm gonna end this part right here. I hope you guys are enjoying this DLC. I'm really excited to see like what's gonna happen because I've never played this before so I'm like it's all new to me and um, I just hope we get more answers as to like you know how you know Riley plays into this and like more of like Ellie's backstory because we found out about the mom and I had no idea she was a nurse. So it's starting to make a lot more sense with the letter I found and everything like that. Uh, but regardless, uh, if you guys enjoyed this video remember to leave a like, subscribe and hit the bell button so you know when I upload the next episode for for Left Behind DLC. And of course, if you haven't watched my playthrough of The Last of Us, I'll leave that in the description as well. Anyway, you guys let me know what you think, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye! Stop! What is wrong with you? Is that a body? Like, Himiko's body? Guys, to the main characters. These powerful beasts are known as summons. They are extraordinary beings that can be called into battle by their summoner. They are also depicted as